Before starting this video, I want to thank everybody and send gratitude to all to everybody that share and seen and like this the video about the nine months semen retention video. It really means a lot to me. I never thought that I was <laughs> I know that 300 views is like super a lot for YouTube, but it's like 300 per 300 person watch the nine months semen retention videos. I never thought that I would have 300 views in like so quick bro I, I had in less than 24 hours i already had 200 views she was crazy bro why you shouldn't be a rapper you shouldn't be a rapper because the rap game is rigged what they do is they, they grab an artist and they make the artist like the most popular as possible the reason why a lot of artists that don't make that honestly don't make great songs don't they're not good are always at the top of the charts because they're serving agendas i would get into that in this video about all the agendas that the music industry is pushing but being being a rapper it's not what you think rappers do not have freedom and they don't have control over the music that they drop they, they have to make music every day and do everything the label tells them to do. I think a lot of guys want to be a rapper because they don't want to work a 9 to 5 job with a boss who tells them what to do every day. But being a rapper is basically the same thing. You are, you are controlled. The thing when you work a job is you clock in, you do what your boss tells you to do, then you clock out and you go home. And you can chill and do whatever you want. But when you're a rapper, you can't even do that. You have It's like you're working 24-7. Your life, when you're a rapper, your life becomes your job. You can't drop the songs you want to drop. And you can't, you can't even choose which songs you want to drop. And you have to go where they tell you to go, even if you don't want to be there. And you can't talk about certain things that you want to talk. Like, for instance... If you want to, if you want to talk about, I don't know, uh, if you want to talk about certain stuff and spread awareness on Instagram, you can't even do that. The labels and the people who have control over you will not let you speak about real shit. They will always, the only thing they will let you do is to spread, is to, so yeah, you might think, okay, I don't have a lot of freedom, but at least I make money yeah but no rappers are not that rich because the money you earn it's not yours the money you will earn being a rapper is the label's money like when you make money is when you make money is because the label the label make money off your back and what did and what they do is like for example you do a show you make a hundred k for the show they will Maybe they will give you like, I don't know, 20K, but the under 80K, they will keep it because it's in, because it's in your contract. Let's say you're a big rapper and you sign a big contract of $2 million. It's not your money. It's a loan. You have to pay it back. You could be, you could be independent, but it's going to take you years before you really make money like that. And the hardest thing about being a rapper is that competitive nature of the rap game in the longevity because yeah you might blow up but for how long you're gonna be hot that's the real question you gotta ask yourself and there will and there will always be another rapper that is going to come out and don't let that rapper have a similar style to you because if another rapper comes out and he has a similar style to you and he's like he makes better songs Bro, <laughs> you're gonna lose a lot of money, man. If you go independent, and depending on what you talk about in your songs, you might get blackballed by certain radio stations and main in mainstream platforms. Or when there's a big show or event, you can't go there because you're not signed. You know, on Spotify, this playlist, maybe like, just because you're independent, you might not make the playlist. Even if like, your songs 
you have songs with more streams than other songs on the playlist, you might not make the playlist because you're not signed. Another reason why I think a lot of guys want to be rappers is because they think the shit is easy, but it's really not. If you really want to blow up and be good at it, you have to make at least one song a day. And even if you don't drop every song you do every day, it's not the point. The make the point is to be better at is to be better at making songs. The thing I don't understand is back then I used to know like guys who rap and shit. And you told me and you tell me shit like oh it's just a hobby, shit like that, but they spend like two hundred dollars on a music video like if it's just a hobby, why do you spend money for it? Like, why do you invest so much money over a fucking music video, but you don't get any return on your investment? You have to make songs every day, but you have to have a different sound than everybody else. You have to be original. You can be just like another rapper. Honestly, there's a really slim chance that you really have it in you and that you're really going to blow up because it's not even your purpose in life to do that shit. And bro, the only reason why guys want to be a rapper is just for the clout. I swear to God. I don't know why you do shit for the... I guess I don't understand why people really like to have clout. But it's really for that reason. You don't rap for the right reasons. If you don't rap for, if you don't rap for the right reasons, you will not blow up. It's just how the universe works. If you can't make a song without talking about shooting, robbing people, fucking hoes, smoking dope, and giving money, you're not a rapper. Because if you're just talking about that, you just repeat the same thing that you're listening in your favorite songs, but in a different way. So you're not really a rapper, you're just like copying the shit they say because it sounds cool. And like, you're twisting in your own way. And you expect to blow up like that. The truth is, you are programmed to want to be a rapper because what they show you in rap videos, like the guy has a lot of money, he has holes, and he has nice things, he has chains and everything. Like when I was younger, I, I was like 14. Of course, every 14 year old wants that shit because they think like, oh, okay, if I had money, I have chains, I have bitches, I'll be happy, but it doesn't work like that. And it's just an illusion, by the way. like. They don't really have that much money. Yes, they might have, yes, they might have like nice things, but it doesn't mean anything because most rappers are miserable. Why do you think rappers do so much drugs? It's because they're fucking miserable, man. They're fucking depressed. They're fucking tired of being a slave to the fucking matrix. That's why they're doing drugs every day. Like for example, Juice World before he died, he always type like Juice World before he died. Like he always talk about how. Like, he always had to take drugs because he feel bad and shit. I know that's part of the agenda that he was forced to push, but it was the truth. Like, he really, take, he really took drugs because he was feeling super depressed and feel bad about shit. Because who would feel depressed if you are a fucking slave, bro? You are fucking programmed to, be a, to want to be a rapper so you can, like, destroy yourself. Because... What they show you in rap video is, okay, you smoke dope, rob, shoot people, and you will be rich. <laughs> If you do drugs, rob, shoot people, and do and sell drugs and shit, the only place you will end is in prison or in a coffin. I don't want to be on some moral shit, but it's really the truth. The only way you can get, a, get away with it is if you turn around, if you turn your life around, if you, or if you really have OGs in the hood. That's the only way you're gonna get away with it. But most people don't have OGs and most people are honestly are dumb. They don't know how to really do this shit. So that's why they get caught, man. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe to my channel for more content like this, and share this to a friend. Peace.